from NBC News, this is Today with Matt Lauer and Ann Curry, live from Studio 1A in Rockefeller Plaza. And good morning. Welcome to Today on a Wednesday morning. I'm Matt Lauer. And I'm Ann Curry. Just ahead, the 72,000 square foot mansion being built out of concrete in Missouri. Up next, the mystery surrounding the massive 72,000 square foot concrete mansion that is now rising in Missouri. We're going to take you inside one of the largest homes ever built in the U.S. right after this. Back now at 748 with an inside look at the mega mansion being built in the Ozarks. The 72,000 square foot home, that's right, 72,000 square foot home is the source of many rumors. Are Hollywood stars moving in? Could it be a bunker for Homeland Security? Well, NBC's Kevin Tibbles is in Highlandville, Missouri with the tales on this. Hey, get, you have some answers, Kevin? Good morning. And you can just imagine the rumors, people wondering, what are they doing way up there on the hill? Well, this is what they've been doing. They've been building Pensmore, a modern-day, state-of-the-art, energy-efficient, disaster-proof castle. There is a loosely-derived contraction from the French root for thinking, pens, and the English False. word for more. More. False more. Pens so, more. Pens more. Pens more. Special estate than ever. All the brainchild of successful software entrepreneur Stephen Huff, who designed... Pass your thinking heating and cooling a house this immense would probably bankrupt you. I know it would me. Except Pensmore is so energy efficient, they're not planning on spending a dime. Actually, Brad Pitt does hail from nearby Springfield, Missouri. But no, he and Angelina and the kids won't be moving in. Neither will E.T. and his alien buddies... Mm. Yeah. Does he always say yes whenever you ask him for stuff? <laughs> and Pensmore, playroom and all, is on schedule to be completed by late 2013. Is there anything you forgot? <laughs> if I knew that, I wouldn't have forgotten it. <laughs> And guys, Stephen Huff became so enamored with this new insulated concrete technology, he ended up buying the company and building Pensmore out of it to test it all. But of course, uh, he hopes for the future that they're going to be able to build more energy efficient and safer schools, hospitals, someday maybe even homes. Um, I'm now standing in the Great Hall, and I've got to tell you guys, I've already got my dibs on this. I know exactly what kind of sort of, you know, kiss posters and stuff I'm going to put on the wall <laughs> yeah. in here. The yeah. view of the yeah. Ozarks. <laughs> All right, Kevin, thank you so much. The view much. of the Ozarks is spectacular. Good. Right, More coming up.